back to Jack 2 for my LPs once again. Saving Sig from the Unreport was done on its second and last part, and this left off just before doing the mission to defend the stadium and also to transport the, this Rift Rider here uh, uh, made uh, to get the uh, duo back home to get to the Lurker Balloon on the other side of this, this section of the stadium. It might take a few a few takes here, but I won't have to worry about screwing up the part because it's saved ar around here. So if I am able to get like, if I'm able to like, if a Samos is taken out, I can just reload and I'll be able to have all of the, the the 22 of the skull gems I had before and redo the mission again, and be able to defeat the metalheads again for the skull gems. So I won't have to worry about this part being screwed. But I have to destroy the, the those uh, destroy those crates because I need to get the ammo to be high for this one. Metalheads are going to show up and try to get the get the same old. I got successful. Away. Must be nice floating away while we die down here. We'll meet near the nest. See you soon, Jack. Be careful. Yeah, Jack. Be careful. Yep. Ben's gonna save her one last time to go to the construction site. I won't be able to get the giant dark jack ability until uh, after the game because, because the metal had nest would uh, bring it up to a hundred. The construction site is the next place to go. And once again, the stadium here is completely been deserted. If any metalheads have any extra skull gems, I can probably get them on the way. But I better watch out for the ones that are, you know, close. Is there a vehicle nearby I can use? Oh. Okay, come on, yeah, let's we'll steal a civilian vehicle. I better get my ammo up before going to the metalhead nest, so before I go there, I'm going to get, get it back up by going to the gun course and destroy all those crates multiple times. They don't seem to be dropping any skull gems at this point forward. The Baron is going to get killed in this next area. Thor is going to kill him, and so and all of his guards will get taken out too. Well, I guess that was ammo anyway. I thought it was a skull gem for a second. I 
guess all the guards that get taken out, I can grab the ammo they draw. There's also one precursor orb at the construction site to grab too, so I better not uh, better not forget about that. And it's actually the same construction site that's in the Daxter game. It's just a, a small, a smaller, uh, a smaller area than how it looked in da Daxter. In the Daxter game, it was much bigger. In fact, there were a lot of climbing platforms in that one. This just shows a, a small piece of it. Here's the construction site. Cutscene playing here. Core, what's going on? I am sure you know. Deep down in your darkest nightmares. We've met before. Metalhead leader. Everything's going exactly as planned. <laughs> Jack! Crazy to try that. You are the supreme weapon, Jack. And I made you still. And you mean it with assault? This has his backup plan. Remember, the first rule of making a bomb is to always make two. Bye bye, Baron. Yep, Ashlyn's now on her, her own now. There's a precursor orb over there. That's the only one that, that's there. So there, it's once again time to go back. And Ashlyn's gonna say, say in the communicator to go to the Metalhead Nest as it's a good time to do it, since they are mostly attacking the city instead of defending their nest. I'm definitely gonna need full ammo for the Metalhead Nest, so I'm gonna go to the gun course and, and get back up on the, that ammo. have to actually stop here and just get and just refill on ammo in the next part so that takes care of defending the stadium and getting the rip rider over to the metalhead nest and there's a construction site and the, the metalhead nest is next for our first half sign off